So today I wanted to show you my hypo kit slash emergency bag diabetes case. I don't really know what to call this video but it's going to be everything I keep in just the one case regarding diabetes. So for those of you that are new to my channel and perhaps don't know I am a type 1 diabetic and diabetes is a absolutely tremendously huge part of my life. So I have purchased just a pouch that I can shove in my bag and know where everything is. It's all in the one place and it was super inexpensive as well so I just want to get straight into it, enough rambling and show you what case I have. So I have this elite bag, it's in like a grey colour um, with just brown detail, the brown zips, um, the actual zip itself is grey and I think this is a really good looking bag especially for the price I paid. I think I only paid about £18 for this from Amazon. I will leave the link for this in the description because it is such a bargain. If you're looking for one, um, I know for myself I've been looking for a long time to find an inexpensive one because honestly I just never knew how much I'd actually like to use one and um, I've seen some others like the Myobatic cases which I absolutely adore but I just didn't want to put that amount of money into a case if I wasn't going to use it efficiently. Um, so. I started off with this one, this is like a starter case. So I just want to get into it and show you and tell you everything that I keep in this case. So I did actually have this keychain with an M on and I put this on the zip for the main part of the blood meter case. So it opens up really nicely and inside is a lot of space. So in this zip up case is where I keep my needles. Um, just for the finger prick pen, this also has a velcro pocket which is super tough to get into um, but I think that's a really good thing because it's a place where you can just keep your sharps and stuff if you really need to. I use this space here for my blood glucose pen, this is where I keep my blood glucose strips and this is where I keep the meter. Um, if you're wondering what meter I'm using, this is the contour next lick and this is the blood meter that works alongside the Medtronic pump but this is what my front main case looks like and this is the case that I go in every single day. We then have this middle pocket along here. Um, this is where I keep spare pump supplies and insulin and stuff like that. So in here I have my Medtronic Mio um, pump set up. I have my vial of insulin which I've only just opened and I've probably only got about one more use left of it. Um, so I keep that in there. I also have the, I never know what these are called, the syringe thing to put the insulin in. And I'm not going to get it all out but also at the bottom I have my insulin pen and just three needles in case my pump fails while I'm out. So I'm not going to BS you guys, this case and this pocket in particular um, isn't the biggest. We have to keep this sort of cassette thing in our case. Um, in case of emergencies and like it's a very tight push in here um, I don't this is my one thing so when I'm doing this one up I have to like kind of just hold it all together and zip it up but it still zips up without any issues like I've just zipped that up in seconds so it's really it's not that much of an issue but I just wanted to be very clear with you I didn't want to say that this case is brilliant and it fits loads of stuff because it isn't it is a tight squeeze um, but it does the job so for this final pocket which is on the back this is the front this is the back is where I just keep a few sweets now I'm not gonna get them all out um, but I just keep fruitellas in here I find they're the best sweet that work for me I am a mum so I've always got a changing bag, I've always got snacks on me whether they're for my baby or for myself so I don't worry too much about putting another snack in here, I just keep the sweets um, so they're not hard to find if I'm having a hypo, I know straight away where to go, I feel like the snack is something I can deal with after my hypo has been treated. What I also like about this case is this little handle, I think it's quite cool when you're just walking, if you've got nothing else to carry, you can just put it on your hand like this and kind of just walk and you've got it all with you. Like I said, I'm going to leave a link down in the description below for you if you like it. I 
pretty sure they come in other colours too, but I personally prefer this one. I just thought it's really plain, really simple, not too much. You can't really grow out of anything that's too plain. That's going to be everything for this video. If you've enjoyed it, be sure to give it a thumbs up and also click subscribe down below. I post more videos like this. I am also posting motherhood, lifestyle, organisation, just all the videos like that. I'd really love you all to join the channel, you know, feel free to click subscribe. Hopefully I'll see you all in my next video. Bye guys!